channel. Now in this particular video, I'll be creating this simple fire design. Just a simple social media design. Okay, let's just go straight here. So that I have the first of these. I'll be creating a text. Okay. Now for the for this particular design, I made use of couples of up cool vibe. Copy, paste. Oh, sorry about this. Then the next thing is changing the font. Make it poppins bold. You can actually use any font of your choice. I just said to use poppins bold. Now alignment should be at the center. Then I will just click on it and. Come to relative size. Let me increase the size. And um, okay, was well, good. You just reduce the line spacing. You know what? I just thought of something. Let's just copy this, duplicate. No, let's delete this first. Let me still increase the size. Okay, so I have this. Okay, uh, I'm quite okay with this. I'll just now the way it is seems there's a mistake somewhere. Um, it's not appearing to be at the center. And that is a problem because I really, really want it to be at the center. It's appearing as if there is peace. On night, I really, really need this thing to be at the center. Okay, let's just go on with this. So I'll leave this here, this particular one, and I'll just copy it to position it here. Now I'll try to make my space even. I guess this is okay. So the next thing I'll come here and come to color, click on plus, then draw this side here so you're not seeing anything. Then I'll come to stroke, then change the color. I'll just leave this for right. So we'll come to this state for the background, turn it to transparent, then save as image. So we'll be heading straight to Pixart. Okay, our image is saved. Okay, now we have this recent. Okay, um, recent images. Okay, I now have. My phone is just rebooted, so I just I have them now. So I'll come to tools, come to stretch, and by default is on wrap, on wrap. Sorry, so I'll just stretch this. You know what? Let me stretch this. Oh, okay. Then bring this side down. Then just throw here. I hope you can see my hand. It's giving me like a wavy feeling. Look at. Okay. 
question. No, I, I, I believe I stretch that side too much. Okay, let's just make do with this. Let's just make do with this. I'll click on this check mark, then I'll click on download. Alright, so we are good. Then just says it, don't save, whatever. So we are back to Pixel App. So just hide these two texts. Now your background can be any color or your choice, but can be any color. Let me just make it black. So this particular element, very, very important. I'll just stretch it open. So this is what I use for my background, this tomato, this tomato. So I just stretch it, make it wild. Then just keep it like this. I can just successfully lock it. Still on the tomato, I'll go to this guy here. Come to color filter. Reduce the brightness. Okay, and now just increase the contrast a bit. Alright, so with this done. Okay, I decided to break this element in. Or well, you can't see it now. Alright, let's make it white. Alright, so I'll just increase the size. Okay, I'll just keep it here. Originally, I didn't make it of it in the original design. Now, the resources are really in the description of this video. So, the next thing now, I'll still come to, to my background here. So, I did some editing. I made this 75. Now it's now very much visible. So this guy, my hero. Okay, I'll position him here, move him to the front. All right, so I'll just come to color filter, release the brightness on him, then increase contrast to about 25 All right so I'll leave this guy here now okay I'll just place him there now you can see we actually done with the design just to bring in that guy in this one so this is it cool vibe okay so this is what i'm having cool vibe so I just make sure it's at the center and i'll lock it so this one i can gladly just reduce the opacity Let's see, 60 is kind of okay. Alright, so we're done. We are done. Actually, in the real design, the one I originally did, it took me about 15 minutes to do because I, I actually created an element of my own CF Zazis. So the graphics, so still make it pop in, but this time should be popping in medium. Okay, and make it this one. Um, we have this just with the size. All right, so we have this guy here. So this is done. So this was the element I created. I came to shape circle. Reduce the opacity. So just maybe creative. Anyway, zero. Okay, this is for the stroke. Ok, 
click on OK then make sure it's at the center copy stretch it out a bit in the center copy stretch it out a bit to the center copy copy okay copy the same thing stretch it out copy stretch it out then we just come here and we'll merge them together every one of them so this is me being creative now all right so i gladly reduce the opacity of this guy then i just stretched it out now it's creating like circle 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 i know music has to do with a wavy feeling that's why i can either use this one this one or this one so it's your choice so we can now gladly save let me save this one instead save all right 11 minutes so you can just decide to spice this up a bit for this one Maybe you can just use this element. Let's bring it to the front. Just like musical, musical, all this musical stuff. So we can just spice it by adding color. If you click on this and um, the color. Okay, now I'll take the brighter part of the yellow. Then steal from the guy's clothes. So if you see on his clothes, he has some kind of colors that. So if it's, it's you, if you just like, then color, click on this, the eyedropper to steal from this one. Right, so I don't want to be make it too much so you can save. But let me just work with the other one I'm, I've already saved. So you can see if I'm still come and make use of it, but just for the sake of this tutorial, I don't want to make it too much. Or you can also come here and add a bit of shadow to it just to spice this thing up. Add click on to shadow. Then all right, then I'll use one of these guy. Okay. Just reduce the strength. So I'll just use one of them, but anyway, I'm not using them. We just stick with what I'm having click come to here come to this guy let's see I don't want to make this video long let's come to ascent to it when we have ascent to it we'll just go and reduce the saturation and we're good to go all right so it's kind of okay like this it's even blending very very well in the background but in case you still don't like the saturation come to view edit just come to tune image and oh it's quite of okay anyway edit okay it's loading now then just move your hand on it and come here reduce the saturation to to about let's make it 15 oh it's still it's still almost every click on curve all right so i can gladly save now we're done with this all right please do not forget to subscribe we'll see in the next video